Hello and welcome to another how-to video. In this video we are going to learn how to backup footage. We would want to make a backup of footage when we want to save some video for a coach or a cheer for an employee or if we just want to keep a video of an event that happened. Um, we will be doing this by opening up the view log, we'll locate some footage to backup, we'll then open up the backup menu, we'll change the storage location and a few settings, we'll then make the backup and then open the backup. So let's get to it shall we? First, of course, we need to open up the view log. So we just come up to the upper right hand corner and click on the view log. After a little pause, everything pops up. And then we locate some footage that we want to make a backup of. We're going to go ahead and click here, go to that, come to here, right here. And now we are going to open up the backup menu. This is accomplished simply by right click and hold on our mouse and then we drag over the timeline that we want to make a backup of. We're just going to do a couple of section of a couple of minutes here where our employee acknowledged a uh, customer who requested a menu. We're going to save that as a cheer. When we let go, we have our backup menu. We come up and we select the backup option and we get this menu. We can further tweak the time frame up at the top if we want to. Down below, we select the cameras that we want to include. We can include all the cameras, or we can click here and select none of the cameras and then pick the individual cameras that we want to have included. For example, the hostess station and the bar drink distribution area. Next, we just press OK. Over here is where we decide where we want to store the video. If we have a flash drive, we can go ahead and put that in and save it to that, or we can just use our file that we have created for the various employees that we have. When we have all the settings how we like, we just simply press OK and the backup process begins. We will skip to the end of the backup. Once the backup is completed, we simply press OK, and it is complete. Now we just simply need to locate the backup, and that is found by pressing the Windows key on our keyboard, and we launch File Explorer, and we simply navigate to where we found our backup, and here it is. Once inside the folder, all we have to do in order to view the backup is run the program right here called Easy View Log. We double click on it and we will be presented with a player that has all the same options as our regular player. So we can click and drag our cameras into the layout, maximize it. Down here we have a timeline. The only difference is this timeline does not have an option for having the little pop-up preview window, but we can simply click and have our earlier playback controls as if we were using the regular software. This particular backup will play on any system that is running Windows. And that's it. When we are all done, all we have to do is close the window. We can close our file explorer too. And we're done. Thanks for watching. Please be sure to check out our other how-to videos on how to get the most out of a Hoptic system. And please be sure to like our videos and please be sure to visit the website at hop720.com.